All right, state your name and power. I am the Waffler. With my griddle of justice, I bash the enemy in the head, or I burn them like so. Oh, <laughs> don't do that. Ooh. I also have uh, my truth syrup, which uh, is low fat. Mystery Man was released in 1999, and it's about the kind of mundane lives that some superheroes lead. Mystery Man is the debut film from director Kinka Usher. He is one of the most famous commercial directors of all time, having helmed the commercials for Got Milk and the Yokero Taco Bell commercials. Mystery Man looks at what happens when there's planned obsolescence applied to the concept of superheroes. Captain Amazing, played by Greg Kinnear, is too good at his job. He has defeated all of the foes and is losing his brand sponsorships as a result. Therefore, he releases one of the most infamous criminals of all time, played by Jeffrey Rush. I have created a beautiful machine that is going to encourage our fellow citizens to share my vision or the world. Mystery Man satirized comic book culture long before the superhero universe became dominant in filmmaking as it is today. We have a character whose superpower is bowling. We have a character whose superpower is wielding a shovel. And a character whose superpower is that he's really mad. You might recognize another superhero franchise in this film, and that's because director Kinka Usher used the sets from Batman Forever, Joel Schubacher's 1995 Batman film. In terms of subverting the genre and satire, Kinka Usher really takes up the baton from Joel Schumacher and what he did with Batman Forever in 1995. Lance Hunt wears glasses. Captain Amazing doesn't wear glasses. He takes them off and he transforms. That doesn't make any sense. He wouldn't be able to see. There's a great cameo mystery man from famed magician Ricky Jay. He plays the publicist for Captain Amazing. And I love at one point in the film where he points out to Captain Amazing that he's not a magician, he's a publicist, when in fact, he really is a magician. Look, I'm a publicist, not a magician. You want big news, you have to have big fights. A superhero needs a supervillain, and thanks to you, we've got none left. Didn't get the... the death Man. Death Man is dead. It's a film that really understands what at heart is appealing about a superhero story and kind of makes fun of that. Hi, everybody. You know, tooth decay and gingivitis can be a crime. That's why I use Mighty Whitey Toothpaste. Because I want my teeth to look amazing. <laughs>